The whole intent behind these Semiosis 101 videos is that I place piercing semiotic theory in more design central terms. Pierce's technical language that he uses in the semiotic theory is a big blockage for graphic designers or illustrators if you are reading Pierce from scratch. Because we don't use his terms, nor have we ever come across his terms in our designing. So let me replace Pierce's words for how semiosis works with words we do use and words that designers and illustrators can understand. Okay? So here's my translation of what Pierce is saying in the terms of visual communication design and his semiosis. How the concept is represented and then how that representation is then interpreted by our audience are essentially the fundamentals applying.